So as Michelle said, when we were talking about what the prayer team was going to do coming into the fall season, we looked around the world and what we saw was so much anguish and so much anger. And I thought I would like to ask that we all pray for peace. And I'm not talking about global peace, I'm talking about inner peace. I see so much effort and energy poured into being angry or frustrated. And it's so debilitating mentally and physically. And if we can come to approach things with God's peace, that of course he sends us out into the world every week in peace to serve him and serve others, we could do so much more for this world. So for the month of September, I'm asking you all to take a deep breath. And when things you see disturb you, face them with peace. And if you want to make change in this world, go about it in a peaceful manner. So much more can take place in that way than in spending your energy on so many negative things that produce nothing. After the service, I would invite anyone who would like to come forward to join in a circle, because it's what I'm most comfortable with, to pray this week, of course, for Lucy and for anyone that might need prayer. And I'd like to remind you that we have quite a few black robes and prayer shawls that anyone who's in need, we would be most happy to give them to. It doesn't have to be someone from the parish. And I wanted to end with just one little prayer that I was reminded of yesterday. I was at a college soccer game. And uh, my daughter coaches a college team. My daughter is not a very, she may be a prayerful person, but you do not see her in this church except on Christmas and when she comes to visit me. And last year, the father of one of her players was dying from leukemia. So I went to one of the games and she asked me if I would come up and pray with the team, which I did. And the mother was there. And I did not then see the father again all last year because he spent most of the year in the hospital. Well, yet he had a um, uh, stem cell transplant in uh, the winter. And yesterday he was at the game. And he said, medicine did amazing things for me. I have a whole new immune system. But you and that team are what brought me back. And that's an example of prayerful intervention in a peaceful manner to bring a change in the world. So I send you out to go in peace and love and serve the Lord. Amen.